it's a way of thinking, it's a, a way of creating a space where you can experiment and try things out. I'm one of the printmaking technicians here at um, Central St Martins and I work mostly in woodcut. Um, that's my main way of working. Well, the reason that I use woodcuts is for me, of all the processes, it's the one where I find the most space for experimentation and to try things out. The way that you can build up lots of layers and also use a lot of colours. So I often start with a, a digital image because I try and bring a lot into the, the woodcut. And obviously one of the good things about printmaking is that you can just bring lots and lots of different techniques into the process. And I don't like to see any white paper remaining on the print, except maybe in the, the board around the edge of the image. So I like to make really quite dense images. And I usually work in a reductive way. So although I, I mainly start with one block and I then print, cut into that block, reprint for each layer, I often incorporate and bring in lots of older layers from older blocks and overprint them in between different layers of the, the image. I start with a, a plan of each layer that I, I kind of trace onto the, the block to cut. I don't want anything too planned. It's quite important that, that the image, the process, especially print, has to remain fluid. There has to be space for change, experimentation. If I really like colour, I use a lot of fluorescent colours in my work. Before I know it, after about 12 layers, the inks become really quite thick. The starting point of my work has always been photography and I work in the dark room and I take a lot of photos, often with quite cheap cameras that I've bought in charity shops that might have cost £1.50. When I take photographs, they're often of small details. It could be the oak, something you know, on the edge, or the, on the periphery, something overlooked. It could be just a small detail.
process creates a distance between you and the marks that you create. And I think that distance, that otherness is quite important for me. I think when I've made a piece of work, I kind of almost want it to look like I didn't do it in a sense. And then, then it kind of takes on something of its own.